Think you know the difference between an asset and a liability? What if I told you that 90% of people get it wrong and it's costing them big time? Let's uncover the forbidden secrets that can change your financial life. First off, let's set the record straight. An asset puts money in your pocket while a liability takes money out. Simple, right? But here's where it gets tricky. Many think of their primary residence as an asset. However, unless it's putting money in your pocket, it's actually a liability. Every month your home demands payments, mortgage, taxes, maintenance. If you're spending, not earning, it's a liability. Point two, the role of income generating assets from rich dad, poor dad. Now onto the golden eggs income generating assets. These are your best friends on the road to riches. We're talking rental properties, stocks paying regular dividends, or a side business. These assets work for you, bringing in regular income without you punching a clock. Imagine owning a small apartment building. Instead of paying rent, you collect it. That's money making money. Point three, behavioral finance and liabilities. Behavioral economics shows us how we're often our own worst enemies. Psychological biases like instant gratification lead us to make purchases that feel good now, but are liabilities in disguise. But buying that flashy new car on credit feels great today, but strains your finances for years. Recognizing these biases can help us make smarter choices, choosing assets over liabilities. The truth about assets and liabilities isn't just in understanding them, but in applying that knowledge to skew every financial decision towards building your wealth. It's about making your money work for you, not the other way around. Now that you know these secrets, what changes will you make? Are there assets you need to reevaluate? Share your thoughts in the comments below, and if you found this video helpful, give it a like. Remember to subscribe for more insights and check out our next video popping up right now.